Hi friends and subscribers, this is Mamu Sheikh and from past few videos I am working on developing a college management system using PHP is one of the widely used framework code writer. In my last video I completed the functionality of deleting the students from the database and in this video I will display all the co-admins whenever user click on this drop down okay here I will create a link as view co-admins so whenever user click on this view co-admins link another page will get open where you will be able to see all the co-admins who have been assigned to our colleges because of our developing that kind of functionality we need to first go to our editor and first need to click on this inc here i have a header for php inside this i have to create a link copy and then i'll put it here and then i will change it to view co-admins okay and then change it to co-admins okay so now i need to create this function co-admins inside my admin.php file so i'll just copy this and then come come to admins.php file and here i'll create a function co-admins okay and then let's see inside co-admins function okay now save it now let's refresh the page and let me just click on this drop down here i will find a link called view co-admins i will just click on it and it will take me to co-admins function here it's saying inside co-admins function so here i need to call a view load view co-admins okay i'll cut Put it here okay so i will create a view called view co admins inside my views folder so i'll right click on it and then click on new file and then i'll just save it as view co admins dot php okay so here i will next go to my dashboard and then i will just copy the entire code and then i will put it inside co admins Okay, I'll just click okay and then I'll just press ctrl c to copy the entire code and then I'll come to Vuko admins and then I'll just paste it out okay, here so I'll just remove all these links okay I'll change it to view co admins okay then I'll just change it to name username and then college name okay and then email gender okay okay and then that's all I don't want branch just save it okay so these many information I want to display for my co-admins okay so for getting the co-admins i already created the function for that okay so now let me just go back to the dashboard okay admin.php 146 hp 46 okay here that should be a semicolon okay now let me just refresh the page okay here the our view co-admin page will be somewhat similar to our dashboard page okay here you can see inside this table i am displaying college name username email role gender and branch okay so i want the branch as well in my view co-admins okay so here the same piece of information i'll be displaying whenever i click on this view co-admins link okay so since i have already created this function here if i go to my dash admin and at the top here you can see i have created the function view all colleges okay so i will call the same function okay i will just copy and i will put the same data inside my 
view coordinates okay so that i don't have to create the same function again okay i'll just copy this and then i will put it and i will pass this in the form of an array to my view coadmins page okay i will just copy and then save it okay so the, i will change it to coadmins just copy here and then i'll just paste it here okay then now let me just come to view coadmins here you can see i have since i have copied the entire code from my dashboard.php so previously here it was users so now i have changed it to coadmins so here also i need to change it to coadmins coadmin just copy just copy and then i'll just paste it here okay so now welcome to your queries I uh, will go to that function view all colleges function okay here I will select okay here I have selected the user ID field from TBL users so I will just call I will use this user ID field instead of college ID since co-admins are the users so I will just put the ID field of that uh, of those co-admins okay and then college name and i want email okay first i want username and then college name and then email and then gender okay and then branch okay i'll just i don't want this link so i'll just remove this action as well okay i'll just save it okay now let me just refresh the page and now when i click on this drop down i will find a view coadmin so i will just click on this okay so it's displaying me an error undefined property queries okay so in admin.php 145 admin.php 145 okay so i have not loaded my model so i will just okay and now let me just refresh the page okay now you can see it's displaying me all the coadmin okay so now at the top i will put an hr and save it okay so i'm displaying all the co-admins okay so these are my co-admins this is these are the ids for those co-admins and their username and the college name to which they are assigned to and their, their email gender and branch okay so if i added few more colleges and then if i assign some different co-admins to those newly created colleges then all those colleges and their co-admins will start displaying on these tables okay so now if i want to go to dashboard then i just have to click on dashboard then i'll be redirected to the dashboard okay this is how we can develop the functionality of displaying the co-admins for our college management system okay this is the last video of our tutorial series of developing college management system in this last video i would suggest you guys to watch this tutorial series complete from the beginning from the first video then only you will be able to understand each and every concept of code igniter and then you will learn a lot if you learn if you watch this series from the beginning okay so uh, i hope you like this video i hope you got some useful and valuable information out of this video if you like this video click on like button share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching